Hey guys, it's time to do word of the day. Let's see what our new word is. Remember last week, we talked about suffixes and suffix S was the one we talked about. What does suffix S, how does it change the base word? So we start with our base word and then we add a suffix S. How does it change our word? That's right, it makes it plural. Our base word is singular, which means one. Then when you add an S, it means more than one. Let's check out our word. Let's tap it out. Sh it ship becomes ships. Did you remember we read the base word first and then the whole word? Let's keep trying and practicing some more. This is how we'd mark it. We're gonna remember to underline our digraph. We're gonna circle our base, our suffix rather, and underline our base, okay? So this week, we are going to go back to underlining our digraphs, putting our stars, boxing our glued sounds, all of those things we're gonna remember to do, okay? So let's keep going. Remember guys, before we start reading all these other words with suffix S, we want to read our base word first and then read the whole word. Okay? So let's tap it out. Mm, op. Mop becomes mops. Let's tap this one. Am. Ham becomes hams. Let's do this one. Ch, if, n, chin becomes chins and fan becomes fans okay ships i have many toy ships we have a second word today shells <laughs> shell become shells and we'll mark it by Underlining our base word, circling our suffix, and underlining our digraph and putting a star above our bonus L. Shells. I have many shells. Okay, we're going to read our words of the day. Here we go. Remember, we can tap these out, but we want to learn to read them quickly. Here we go. Great job today, friends.